Aloha and welcome back to Island Style. You know, we're here at the 10th Annual Rice Festival at Victoria Ward Park, and it's a great event that brings people from around the state together for their love of rice. How do you like your rice? White? brown, hapa, whatever you do, come down and check out the Rice Festival because you can get some Ono food, but also help out a great cause. So we started in 2010. So 2010 was our first year, so this is gonna be our 10th year, 10th anniversary, it's kinda of crazy. Yeah. So, local boy, born and raised. Uh, I grew up on rice. My parents are from Japan, so I grew up on really, really good rice. So, and all the cultures in Hawaii have some kind of rice, paella, you know, risotto, and things like that, uh, sushi. So I thought, what a great way to bring cultures together, uh, get everybody together, have a good time out in the sun, and uh, enjoy each other's company. Hawaii is the best place to do it, right? I've been actually running around so much that I haven't had a chance to see anybody yet, but I know who's here. Uh, we got, um, we have a poke corner, so we got three poke vendors in there. Two Ladies Kitchen, uh, they're from Hilo. They actually shipped us some product, and so we're selling it out of our Aloha Revolution booth. And then we got Rainbow Drive-In, we got a bunch of musubi, got grinds, got a bunch of guys. Uh, Pig and the Lady are here. Just all kinds of cultures represented here. Yeah, we're really blessed and honored to be uh, supported by Howard Hughes Corporation. Uh, we were partnering with them on the Oahe Street before, but they allowed us to come on the park in March for our sister event, Noodle Fest. And so now we're here with Rice Fest, and it's a great, great venue, grass, nice uh, tent set up and everything. So we're really happy, and we couldn't be more proud of the tent here. It makes me so happy. Uh, Ten years of work has been for something at least, right? So, but yeah, like you said, family friendly. Um, thankfully, the weather held up, for hopefully for the rest of the night, but I was a little worried that people weren't going to come, but they're here now, so and we're ready to have some fun. Uh, so we are beneficiaries of Lanakila Pacific. They do the Senior Meals on Wheels program. They're the largest in the state. Um, every, after every event, we donate back to them. So my goal personally is to just increase that goal. So that means more vendors, more sponsorships, more donors. So we're just trying to get more money to uh, them. Yeah, so they, all they do is serve, they don't serve white rice, so they only serve brown rice because it's easier for the seniors to eat, I guess. So um, they're taking brown rice donations all day and before the event as well, and monetary donations as well. So. It's more like a sweet flavor. Uh, there's one called Koshi Hikari that I like to eat a lot. That's from Japan. Um, it's real white. Uh, and real sweet and soft to the, to the texture. So you can tell a big difference when, some, when a restaurant has it. You're like, oh, there it is. <laughs> no, uh, just come down next year. I guess when they see this next year, not, uh, September is National Rice Month, so we're trying to do it every September. 